What I'd like to demonstrate here is uh, the automation on the door electronically, just the same as you have at home with your, your uh, garage doors at home. Uh, this really is a time saver and it's super convenient, especially in the winter time here uh, in Racine, Wisconsin, where we have extreme cold, sometimes heavy snow, heavy winds. Uh, one person, and you can see what I'm gonna do here, I'm gonna get into the tug. <coughs> And using your typical garage door opener, which Tim Chappell has uh, provided as an, uh, an accessory to our installation, all you do is hit the button. And if you look over here, over my shoulder, you'll see that the door is opening. Uh, works very, very well. At any time I want, I can stop the door, or we can go back to closing the door. But let's open this door and let's show us, let's show it how it works when we pull out to do a mission here. And uh, again, if it's inclement weather and it's imperative to get the airplane airborne before it turns into a popsicle, freezing rain, snow, etc., uh, you'll see some of the time savers that uh, the automation on the door provides for you. Uh, if we were pulling this aircraft out, dead of winter. Of course, the hangar is heated, so it's imperative that uh, we try to uh, save as much energy as we can here. We will just hit the close button and uh, close the hangar door. As you can see, it is starting down. And if you choose to stop thing, go hit the stop button right there. Closing the door. Now that would be a typical scenario, and if this was a blustery winter day, uh, and we're kind of taking our time right now because we're trying to put this thing on video for you so you can see how it works. Uh, door is closing, airplane's outside, we've loaded the people inside, it's 20 below zero. And we're on our way to go uh, to go do some flying. Let's go fly. Coming on the left side. So as we return, uh, you can see that the door is going up. Once again, I go back in and climate weather situations and so forth. And we'll hook the tug up now, push things inside. Passengers might stay inside if it's a nasty day or on a day like today, they'd probably leap and run for their cars. Now once again, if you've noticed here, as I'm getting out of the tug, the door is already coming down as it was signaled from the electronic controller inside the tug. Once again, the beauty of the door is it follows a very simple engineering axiom, and that is there is no part to go wrong like no part. Simplicity. Simplicity makes it work.